memoir of a Niger girl. On today's episode, we have bass bones, bass bones flying around. What is the English word for bass bones? Okay, they say that it's too late. You know, because you have to shook. You have to oh, shook. Yes, too. Before you was there, what was that uh, whiskey um, version of a uh, shook? You don't spoil. You don't spoil. So, on today's episode, I have myself, Helen, and I have Ali Miriam. Welcome to the show, Ali. Thanks, baby. It is so nice to have you. Everything is worse. Because I know really? when I sent you that message, and I was like, ah, she, mama, is she around like this? Can you can go, but. It's so nice that you have time and you know, Thank sure, you. of course. You know, so, oh, no, we, we know that in Lagos, hmm. we all have tried different dating scenes, we all have dated different people. So, I'm asking you now, have you dated a mommy's boy before? Um, yeah, I need to be very sincere and yeah, frank with you. I have dated a mommy's boy. Okay, I think having been that is the only boy in the family out of four children the last born yeah. again she understand so um i i won't really blame him when he acts like that when he acts funny and all but i just feel like probably the way he was being brought up you understand so he's is in the midst of four girls you know and they're always pampering him he's the last born um okay i don't want to mention his name so, hey, hey, hey you know you're yeah, this you that you this you that so dating a mommy's boy is not really bad but i feel like when it gets to the next stage that's marriage and all that this is nigeria yeah. how i mean how was it like for you you know dating him and maybe his mom calls and I have to go and see my mommy. Was it was it a problem for you? Honestly, honestly, I, um, it is, right. and it is not. Mm -hmm. So it is in a two-way yeah. dimension. So it is because I feel like when we're meant to have our own private time, time. and you know, his mom just calls or ah, I want to talk to my mom. I want to do this. I want to do that. Hello, okay. we are the one in this relationship. Not me and your mom, or you are your mom. You understand, but the other way around also, I don't really think I got too pissed because he's the only child. That's the only, the only son, yeah, boy, and you know now Nigeria we always pampering our son. We always pampering our only son when it comes to. So I understand this mothering care, but when it gets too much, when it gets too much, whereby the boy doesn't have like it's free it's freedom time and you know more like it's stopped somewhere mm. no i i really don't buy that idea so, so it's really because applicable. sometimes i always ask myself okay if you're dating if i if i was dating a mommy's boy first of all um i think i'm quite dominating when it comes to my relationship you know like yes mm. i want things like this you know i don't want up i don't want your mom to be telling you what to do and um, also, we have this all. Oh, how you have to pamper your son, and you have to bring okay, up your child. I think. Let me come in there. I think maturity again has oh. to do. So now is a different ball game when you are a mommy's boy. Your mom knows everything, and it depends on how you handle the issue. Right. It depends on how mature you have to handle that issue. So some guys or mommy's boy want to tell their mom mom this is what i'm eating today mom this is where i'm going to mom this is what i'm buying and no you don't do that in fact i okay personally my own this one before i think before he had his own freedom of, okay i i want to get my own apartment and oh it took him a while it took him a while because he's He's already into his mom, mm -hmm. you know, his mom food. Um, where are you? Are you close to the house? Are you this? Are you that? Even till now, that he's still on his own right now. I am very sure, though we are not together anymore. So I'm very sure him and his mom, they still have this five and six. It's, it's, it's if you got, if, if for example, you got married to this guy, would you have a problem if his mom was staying with you guys? Deep. Deep, I, think. 
I might have a problem. I might. I might. I need to be frank with you. I might because it is my relationship. It is my marriage, not your mom's marriage. So I might have this issue with him and. I feel like even before the marriage, probably we'll talk about it. Mm -hmm. His mom staying here. Would mom give us our breathing space? I think we need to ask questions. We need to ask ourselves questions to have this conversation. So we don't just jump back ourselves into the marriage, then after one month, six months, yeah. two years, yeah. everybody's going. So we need to ask questions. Even if the guy is not even a moment boy, generally we just need to ask questions. questions. Let's let's be sure about what we are going into. Because I feel like marriage is a lifetime. So sense. this is not a celebrity marriage whereby two months we are out, two weeks we are out. I've heard of the celebrity after a week mm -hmm. and few days, she's out of the marriage. That was because she got married to a mommy's boy, a popular celebrity. She wants them to. I will not tell you. Please not. Not on air. I'll tell Just you. Uh, uh. Yes. Honestly. Honestly. Okay. You say I should not tell you to put in But then, if you are, you know, we, we watch your about movies where the Yako with the knock when they are doing something, you know, and they're having sexual intercourse. And you don't have to be hiding. Yeah. Stuff, yeah. They're having sexual intercourse and the mother in law would come knock on the door. Say, what are you people doing? Do these things really happen? Things okay. I feel like before all these producers, actors act this movie, mm -hmm. these are happenings. This is what is happening. You okay? Fine. You want to write a script? You sit down. Okay, let me draft it like this. Let me draft it like hello. It has happened somewhere. It has happened somewhere. That is why if we if we watch our non wood movies now, most of their movies are based on true life, life stories. Story. So I think things are happening. Would you do it again? No. Not that mommy's boy. No. So the mommy's boys, what do you want them to do? I don't know. You want them one, to do One of them is right, my friend. <laughs> Maybe your mom have. It's not just about oh you being the only son. Some people they have two, three boy child, uh, boy child or boy yeah. children. But then one of them is still quite clingy on you know mommy, 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 mommy. Just it doesn't mean because you are the last born, you are the mommy's boy, or because you are the, it might be the middle boy that is the mommy's boy. So that you're here. I don't know how that you come. Come and show us. Come and show us. Come, come here. You know, it's funny, boy. it's funny how she sees me and then she <laughs> says her mom is boy. I'm, I'm, I'm literally yeah. trying to ask myself that question. Okay. You're seeing her and then you're saying her mom is boy. How do mom is boy look? They look like Diane. They look like Diane. <laughs> <laughs> this is funny. You know, it's it's funny that she's the first person saying that to me. Do you really look like mom is boy? I don't know. You're the one saying it. Not you that. Like. Oh, oh my God. Oh, you guys are looking look at like. each other like this. I'm not looking at each other. Oh, you know, so. <laughs> Daya, would you date a daddy's girl? A daddy's girl? Mm. Mm. Oh, my dad is calling me. I need to go see my dad right it's now. It's going to be a lot of issues. A whole lot. Okay. Uh, will I date a daddy's girl? Ah, I have to think like three times before I answer that. Because I can't imagine saying, Hey, babe, how about we go out now? And then you're telling me you have to get permission from yeah. your dad before we go out. Mm -hmm. Or I'm like, oh, this is a long time. How about we just spend time together? Or, you know, you stay over really the good. night. And then you're telling me, I have to get permission from but my you, dad. But you like um, female child or boy child who are family oriented. Why is family that Family oriented doesn't mean you have to be a line. It should be a line. It should be a line. Boundary. Yes. I like, Hello. see, I like my, I have a sister. Mm. I like her so much. Okay. Do you understand? But that doesn't mean if I want to talk to my girlfriend or my wife, I have to take permission from my sister or my mom. It doesn't make sense. It just doesn't make sense. It's just like me... It's just like I want to eat and then you're telling me I have to take permission first. Personally, I already said my own. 
I've not dated any mommy's boy. I really haven't. I, 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 I also need to say, I haven't dated a daddy's, a daddy's girl. Can so let me do this thing. You understand that? Yeah. Well, it's it's your choice. Yeah, all right. Okay, that's it. Um. Uh, so, any advice for mommies, boys, and daddies, girls? Um. Okay. I feel like I've been into it before. There should be a line. In. You need to. This is my family. Everybody loves this. Our family. Yes. I love my family. I love my brothers. I love my sisters. But there should be this line in, this is my family, this is my relationship. My family are not coming to stay with me in my marriage. Right. They will only be there during my wedding. Okay. But my marriage, I am the one facing it. So, mommy's boy, that when is When you say your... facing it, when you say facing your marriage, yes. it's kind of scary. Like, it's I am kind the one scary. In, I am the one in it. I am the one in it. Okay. I, I need to have my say. I want to eat eba now. I, I don't need to ask my mom. Mom, Ejosheni Obe Ogbononile. Mom, my wife made this. I don't like it. Hello. Can you do let me have charge. charge. Let me have charge in my marriage. Huh. So let there be maturity. Madam, and you? Just what she said. Maturity. Maturity. You're Basically. just going to go. Why of course, that? just maturity. Okay, guys. They say that it's maturity. So guys, on today's episode, we talked about mommy's boy and... Stop pointing your hand, I'm not a mommy boy. <laughs> mommy's boy? <laughs> we talk, and daddy's girl. You are your daddy's girl. And uh, rest your dad's soul. Amen. Yes, you dad. I love you dad. Okay. We all love our dad's so. Okay, so we're good now, right? You don't have to say that you can't... Like, so, so, so. <laughs> okay guys, my name is Helen. Do follow me on social media, Instagram, Helen. Love Memo of a Niger girl on Instagram as well. Miriam, mm -hmm. Halim, thank you so much for coming. Mm -hmm. Daya, thank you for jumping in. Daddy's in. Exactly. You know, boy. Okay. Thank you so I can jump out right now. Jump out, you're Guys, that's it on today's episode. I'm going to see you next week. Mm -hmm.